Visitors to the financial districts shouldn't be alarmed by the seven-foot-tall, six-legged insect. Ibrahim al Shahrani has more on the latest guests to Dubai. Don't worry. Dubai has not been taken over by giant ants. These ant sculptures range from three to seven feet in height and up to 25 feet in length. Absolutely excellent. We saw them putting it up last night and it just looks absolutely great. It looks so real. So we thought that's why I came down today. We go home tomorrow and I thought I'd come down and get some pictures of them. It's wonderful. It's beautiful. I mean, I, I really like it. It's, it's kind of real and uh, it's beautiful, simply. These huge insects are the works of artist Susan Cochran, who's had a lifelong interest in ants. Hailing from Palm Beach, Florida, she says that ants have always been a part of her environment. Absolutely, I make things that uh, people can sit on and that grown-ups can have fun on and children too. And the big ant over there is one you can climb up and have your picture taken or sit on the steps. It's rather hot here though. And uh, I just don't think the grown-ups have enough fun these days. They're all terribly serious and chasing the dollar bill or whatever. And it's time that we just relaxed and had fun every so often. And that's what I do. And my grandchildren like bugs the way I do, so this is what we've came up with. <laughs> As a child, Susan would examine these inhabitants of the undergrowth through a magnifying glass. Oh, I still do. <laughs> People at home think I'm crazy because I'm on the floor and I'm looking, you know, in the bathroom you usually find bugs of some kind and they come up the drains in where I live in Florida. If it rains too much, and earwigs, I have a 15-foot earwig that I love and it's all, you know, you get down with your magnifying glass you can see what they do. By enlarging these creatures she lent us her eyes enabling us to see what she viewed from behind the magnifying glass. That's incredible, I mean I didn't read about this artist, I mean I like a little bit modern art but I don't know exactly this artist and that's what exactly what I was thinking, uh, that he had somehow zoom out uh, uh, some uh, micro uh, animals, yeah interesting. It's very impressive. I mean, um, just looking around, especially at this, I've, I've been to several countries, I've never seen anything quite like this, so it's, it's, really, it's really nice to look at, very easy on the eye, and yeah, job all done, I think, yeah. From their colonies, we can see that ants have been building very complicated and uniquely planned cities for over a hundred million years, and are considered to be among the most organized species on Earth. Ants are highly social creatures and live in large colonies supported by a natural instinct to work together in cooperative and inventive ways. Kind of like the Emirates News Team. Ant colonies rely on intelligent instincts coupled with a demanding schedule and shared responsibilities that result in handiwork that is both reliable and effective. In that case, it would seem that Dubai is a most appropriate location to exhibit these intricate creatures. Brahima Shahrani for Emirates News.